Istanbul's famous landmarks were beautifully blanketed in snow as a winter storm hit parts of Turkey. It's a pretty sight to behold for the city's 16 million people, but a nightmare for travelers. The heavy snow clogged roads, leaving some 4,600 motorists stranded across Turkey, while buses and ferries were also delayed. Private vehicles were banned from Istanbul streets as cleanup began. Snowfall began late last week, but has significantly increased in recent days. At the airport, flights were suspended for a second day Tuesday. Turkish Airlines canceled all flights from the airport, which temporarily closed operations, and workers plowed the snow-covered tarmac. While inside, passengers tried to make themselves comfortable wherever they could. Some were so upset they staged a protest chanting, we need a hotel. But the angry travelers appeared to have calmed down after airport staff gave passengers food and sleeping pods. Airport workers tried to assess the damage after the heavy snow caused the roof of a cargo warehouse to collapse. In Greece, the winter storm dumped eight centimeters of snow on Athens, a rare occurrence for the capital, knocking out power to much of the city as the blizzard conditions caused chaos on the roadways. Rescue crews, including the army, helped dig out drivers stuck in their cars overnight. Many were given food and water as the temperatures fell. We were all trying to move our cars forward inch by inch, but we couldn't. Then I got stuck here last night at least I think, I've lost track of time. We managed to go a further 50 meters and that's it. I've been right here since last night. Some did try to make the most of the situation, like this woman who used skis to get around. Monday's storm also triggered a rare snow-nado, or snowy funnel cloud across Skopelos Island after a water spout moved on shore. Things have been quite messy across Greece and Turkey, to say the least, over the last few days. The region is quite simply just not used to this level of snow. When it comes to Istanbul right now, most of the main roads are open, but it's quite tricky here, especially given how hilly it is to get all of those side streets safely open up to traffic as well. I mean, I'm basically effectively snowed in. And to just give you an idea of how rare this is, Istanbul has not seen this level of snowfall since about 1986. Arwa Damon, CNN, Istanbul.